everyone, sorry today I'm going to Harrods and I thought I would take you with me because I know how much you love my vlogs. I'm gonna go because I have a voucher to spend online and I want to try on some shoes so I can see what size to order. Um, I also have to go pick up a gift for someone special. Um, so I'll be going to Gucci, Chanel, uh, Fendi, of course Fendi and I want to go to Dior as well and see some bags because I've been thinking about getting a Dior bag because um, I need a larger bag and my mum is obsessed with the Dior bags and she's making me buy one <laughs> so I'll go to Dior, uh, see the bags there, see what colours they have I'm not sure if I'll be able to vlog because my camera is really big and um, as you know they don't allow vlogging and like filming uh, inside the boutiques so I will try to include some clips from my phone so I'll be filming with the phone because it's easier and I'll be on my own so <laughs> fingers crossed they don't kick me out from the boutiques I'll show you my outfit of the day later because I'm running very late let's go shopping Hi everyone, I'm on Swan Street, I'm near the Jumeirah Hotel and first stop will be Gucci. I'm a bit cold because I'm only wearing a knitted dress and a uh, scarf. The weather's so miserable today, I hope it's not going to rain because I'm wearing my peekaboo. Do you have more sizes of these or not? I mean, more more, le more, more sizes, sizes left or? Uh, no, one per size. Oh, so these are the, the only yeah, ones you have? Yeah, yeah, because it's uh, to keep the exclusivity of the product, we usually mm -hmm. have one per size. Mm -hmm. And then it's Hello guys, so I'm just near Harrods now, here's Harrods, and I was just in Gucci, I tried on a few pairs of shoes, I tried on the new uh, sandal style, like the mules, and I love them, I think they were my favourite, however, um, if I buy them now I'm not going to wear them because of the weather, so I might wait for them, and instead get the Prince Downs, I tried on a few pairs of the Prince Downs, I've tried them in velvet and leather, and asked you on Snapchat which ones you prefer and most of you said the leather ones <laughs> uh, because they will wear better and the velvet ones, like velvet doesn't really wear that well yeah, let's go to Harrods now stop was Chanel of course wanted to see their new collection however they didn't really have that many items from the new collection um, and the ones they had weren't that great to be honest 
I did pick up a gift, I got a tie, but it's none of these, so if I find it online I will insert a picture. I also had a look at some brooches, I really love this one, but I already have a black one, so I didn't get it, although it's so pretty. <laughs> then I looked at some earrings and I loved these ones, but I wanted them in silver for every day and they only came in gold, unfortunately. I'm doing a voiceover again, hope you don't mind that, but I wanted to explain what I was doing because I couldn't really vlog properly in the boutiques. I was filming from my phone because it was easier, otherwise they would have probably kicked me out. <laughs> I wanted to see their new ABC, I think they're called Mitza, Mitza or tw like Twillies, it's easier. So I didn't really like my letter M. It was quite boring and it was almost the same colour as my Fendi Twilly I picked up recently. So I had a look at the D and I actually really love this one. I think this is my favourite from the whole collection. Uh, from all the letters, D is actually my favourite design. I really love the colour. And D is also for Dior, so that's great. And I also had a look at some Dior Revo bags. I know it in one of my previous vlogs I said I hated those bags but they started to grow on me and now I just can't decide on the colour because I literally love them in every single colour. I don't really like them in the metallics but I love the crocodile ones or I love this grey one, especially this grey one I think I'd wear this colour a lot. The sales assistant actually noticed that my nail varnish matched perfectly the bag. So then I remembered I was actually wearing a dual nail varnish and uh, it was actually funny that the name of that nail varnish was the exact same name like the colour of this bag when she checked uh, in the catalogue, it was called the same way. So I guess this is like an iconic colour for Dior, which is great because I love it. <laughs> Oh, and also this is the medium size, it also comes in a smaller one and one size up. So I just got something from Chanel, that's the gift I was telling you about. Unfortunately I won't be able to show it to you because it's a gift and it's wrapped so I don't want to unwrap it. But it's a men's gift, it's a tie, Chanel tie. So yeah, I asked for a larger bag um, so I can put my big scarf and not like carry it all the time. Um, anyway, I'm going to shoe heaven now to see what shoes, if I've got the light in here. I'm going to go to shoe heaven now to see what shoes they have. Um, then I have to go to the harm section because um, I'm looking for like some inspiration. Oh my god, everyone's like looking at me. Okay, so I'm shoe heaven, harm section, and then I have to go to the beauty section and get something from there from Dior. Uh, I also reserved a handbag which I'll come pick up maybe next week. So yeah, let's go to shoe heaven now. I keep trying these on every time I go to Chanel, but I think they're too dressy for me and I'm not gonna wear them. I think I prefer the Gucci ones instead, but these are so pretty. <laughs> Thank you. 
Next I popped into Dior again to try on some more shoes and I fell in love with these but when I tried them on they looked so funny they made my feet look huge because they're very pointed but oh my god they're so beautiful This is the necklace and this is the charm that is sold separately as well. I just got some leathery. I got something from Chanel and something from Dior and I'm on my way home actually. I'm really tired. I went to see the um, home section but I didn't really vlog there. Um, so yeah, I'm on my way home and I'll show you what I picked up when I get home. I'm back home. I just got home like maybe an hour ago actually. I just kept my mum told her what I saw in her it's shot her favourite Dior bags. I feel so, so exhausted after shopping. I wanted to show you what I got today before I go to bed and remove my makeup. Okay, let me show you what I got. These are all the things I got today. So I got some leathery. I'm expecting a delivery from Gucci. Um, Maybe next week. Sorry, yeah, they gave me my receipt and uh, um, yeah, I think that's my receipt inside. So yeah, I'll be expecting a delivery next week from Gucci. Um, I got some Chanel Dior. The Chanel bag, this one there, the black one, is a present, so I'm not gonna open that. And this is my take take out. Uh, something from the beauty hall as well. Okay, so from Leathery I got some macaroons and uh, some cake. I wanted to show you something. They have these new macaroons in the shape of a heart. How cute are they? Ooh. So I can't wait to try these. Hopefully they yum. I think they I think they said they're ginger. I thought they're raspberry, but they said they're ginger, so I'm not sure if I'll like them. I really really love this one. It's so yum. Look how pretty it is. I got some makeup. So I also ordered a bag um, which should arrive next week. So I'll be going to Harrods again. I got some makeup and they gave me some samples. So let's see what they gave me. They gave me this. This is a base serum. Okay, that's great because I've never actually tried the serum, the base. 90% curl, 38% length, three times volume. Okay, I'm excited to try this. They also gave me, oh, my favorite capture towel. I keep repurchasing this. This is amazing. Uh, skincare products so if you haven't tried it maybe go pick up a sample and then I got this new lip scrub I heard so many good reviews online and I decided to try it actually okay I'm actually wearing it now so this is their newest product it's the Dior lip sugar scrub so this is how it looks on the lips I decided to try it on my way home because my lips were really really dry it feels so nice I can feel the sugar. <laughs> oh, it feels so nice. You should definitely try this. And um, oh my god, it smells amazing. <laughs> it has a slight rosy tint, but it's supposed to exfoliate your lips and remove the dry skin. So uh, I thought I'd give it a go. I think this one was £24. I also got something from Chanel. I got some makeup. Okay, so they gave me two Chanel Chance perfume samples. And then I got the Coco Cold Harmony de Blush. This is the limited edition blush from their um, new collection. Let me open it. I'll probably need both hands again. 
This is the blush. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, oh my god, this is so beautiful. I have no idea how I'm going to dip my brush into this beauty. I think I might buy two and just keep one. You can definitely use this colour and this one as a highlighter. This one actually will look really cool as an eyeshadow. So I will definitely try that as an eyeshadow. And this one will probably look good as a bronzer. So beautiful. I can't stop staring at this. Okay, and last I got something else from Chanel. Again, they gave me some more samples. This is the new foundation, so they gave me three different shades to try. Oh, I forgot to mention this one, the blush, the Coco Cord blush was £50. It's quite expensive, but it's lovely and it's limited edition. And I think it will be sold out soon as well. And last I picked up the Le Beige Kabuki retractable brush. And uh, I wanted this because I don't have a brush for my bag. I mean, I do have like tiny kabuki brushes, but this one has a lid, so it's perfect for your bag. This is like one of the softest brushes I have ever touched. <laughs> it's amazing. It reminds me of the Tom Ford brushes, actually. Also, everything I'm wearing, my makeup, my clothes, uh, everything I got will be listed down in the description box, so make sure you check the description box. Before I go, I wanted to mention my necklace. and I listed it on my Depop for sale, uh, brand new. This is actually the first time I'm wearing it since I got the brand new one. They exchanged my uh, old one that was... I don't know if it was faulty or what was wrong with it. I'll link my old video, uh, my Chanel necklace video below if you're interested and haven't watched it. But I had a problem with my old Chanel necklace. I didn't really did an update video about my Chanel necklace, I think. Uh, so they basically decided to give me a brand new one. I listed it on my Depop and so many people actually wanted to buy it and they offered me a really really good price for it actually they offered more than I paid for it but I just couldn't sell it because it's so beautiful and I decided I would just keep it for now and, but it's so beautiful so yeah it's not for sale at the moment I um, edited the listing on my Depop to let you know that I'm not selling it at the moment I also got so many messages on Snapchat from you today. Thank you so much for sending me messages and helping me decide what shoes to get. I think I decided I know what size to get. So I did mention that I have a voucher which I want to spend online. And uh, now I know which shoes I will get. I know which size I should get them in. And I'm really, really happy. Uh, so yeah, I can't wait to order them as well. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. I, I can't really vlog with this big camera <laughs> in the boutique. So I was vlogging from my phone. So you might notice the difference in the video quality. Some of the clips were taken on my camera. And the other ones are taken from my iPhone 6. Uh, 6 plus? 6 plus? Actually, the quality is not bad, but um, it's easier to vlog in the boutiques with an iPhone. Um, so yeah, um, that's what I wanted to mention. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. I love reading your comments. Uh, thank you so much for your support. Thank you for following and watching my videos. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, and I have a new Facebook page. So go follow me there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for watching again, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Okay, let's try this orange macaroon. It's like eating soap has some weird taste it's a bit soapy I don't know if I like it or not it tastes like soap but I like it <laughs> let me try that limited edition one the heart one Yo, that's awful what the hell is that oh Oh, that aftertaste. <gasps> Ooh, that ginger one.